After the ocean swallowed Atlantis, and before recorded history, there was an age when mythical kingdoms spread across an uncharted world. This was the age of Conan. Enslaved as a boy, Conan grew into a warrior. He escaped to encounter mystery, magic, and myth, while forever facing the ultimate master of sorcery. Lover, friend, hero. was to free the oppressed and become a king by his own hand. Kona. First thing I noticed was that our food supply went up. Volkar was gone. Our friend returned to his homeland for a great feast and decided to settle there. With some of the new sites, I'll get over Volkar's loss quickly, I'm sure. Warriors. Only when we have to be. Warriors always bring trouble. I think they carry it with them in their saddlebags. We will be no trouble to you. All we need is some food and a place to sleep for the night. That's what we were told by him. He has already overstayed his welcome. I have not yet worn out the gold I gave you. When I do, I will leave. Are you like him? First they drink, and after that you steal our women? Stealing women is not what we do. They will not have to steal, they can borrow what they want. Regardless, I must ask you to leave. I'm Conan the Cimmerian, and I'm on my way to Nivida. We have heard about you. There are always soldiers close behind you. You can eat for a price, but you cannot stay longer. I don't want to put you in danger. If there are soldiers behind you, you endanger me. How can I? <laughs> I don't even know you. I'm traveling in the opposite direction. The last thing I need is to be taken by soldiers. Are you a thief? No more than you, barbarian. Do you have a name? I am Bayou Vexucato. I know yours. We pass each other or not? It's your choice. I would rather hear music than your death rattle. So would I.
the road to Al Sambar. Many men have died there. I would not like to be one of them. I know. I left it yesterday. It is strange that we were not followed. You're not grateful for that? You want to go back and fight some more? Al Sonba. Al Sonba. Al Sonba. He is approaching it, and your soldiers have chased him there. Yes, there is something familiar about that name, Al Sonba. The name is also familiar to me, sire. Familiar enough to make the flesh crawl, so to speak. And it suddenly clicked. Cone is dead. We could send in more soldiers, Master. No. Let my evil do it. You are a wondrous devil. You're trying to flatter me. When have you ever known me to lie, Master? I will send my generals to surround the village. This is a trap. Maybe you're too suspicious. I'm still alive. What was that? Everything is where it should be. Why doesn't she speak? Does she have the mind of a child? Does he? No, she is too scared to speak. Silent and beautiful? I think I've just met my next wife. What will happen to her? She is not from this village or any other that we know of, Conan. There's no family or friends to take care of her. Because of that, the villagers feel that she is an evil omen. She's too beautiful to be abandoned. Or an omen. Maybe she'll become one of Lysandra's girls. They don't need to talk. We have to go. Conan. An evil omen. 
Conan, the monster fled from you. All the more fuel for your legend. You put my friends in danger to save yourselves. I hope I never see this place again. What now? surrounded. I'm aligned with you whether I like it or not. The choice is also ours. Didn't make you barbarian. But time is running out. Hmm. My master is impatient. Impatient? Impatient? Of course I'm impatient. This is the third time you've summoned me today, and I know how you dislike parting with your rubies. Who cares about a few rubies when you have a huge sword dangling over your head? I would have thought you'd be used to it by now. I want Conan dead. My generals tell me that Al Sombar is totally surrounded and defended only by Conan and a few farmers. This is the time to attack. You would lose many men, sire. Yeah, who cares about that? Perhaps if you wait, Conan will be killed by the monster without a drop of your soldier's blood having been shed. Yeah. And who cares about a few lives? A little blood. What do we do now? They've been there for several hours. I say we find the weakest spot in their line and break through. There are reasons they do not attack. They know something we don't. We can't fight them and there's nowhere to run. Conan! Those are the soldiers you were fighting before, aren't they? Now you'd like us to leave, wouldn't you, little man? Your fight with his Azul isn't exactly our fight. I had no fight with his Azul till now. Even if I surrendered to the soldiers, they would still kill me and plunder the village. Why? Because they can. You have a family? Yes. Then go back to them. a good meal. Food is strength. This god of yours, Krom, do you think he'll be of much help to me? Only if he chooses to. But Krom expects you to help yourself. Don't you have any god? I carry it in my scabbard. So do I. And what of those who can't help themselves? Then it is my destiny to help them. Or Chrome will have to find some new worshippers. <laughs> <laughs> you find humor in your danger. <laughs>
so much for needing our strength. You saved me twice now, and yet I ask more. Ask? Who am I? You don't know? All I remember is arriving here at the village. The midwife told me you and your friend saved me from some sort of a beast. That's when we first saw you. And not before? You didn't see where I was coming from or if I was traveling with anyone? No. My clothes, were they peasant's rags or perhaps a noble's gown? I saw no clothes. None? You were beautiful. But uh, naked? I only saw your face. <laughs> You're lying. Perhaps. So you weren't trying to escape. You simply wanted to talk to me. Yes. Well, it's not as if that I don't have some time to waste. What do you want, farmer? It's not what I want, sire. It's what you want. Ah, refreshing. Someone who cares about my needs for a change. Continue. You're here for Conan, is that not true? It is true. And what else? I don't understand. Our village. Do, do you have designs on it? No. Only Conan. But hear me well. When the order comes, if I have to, I will level the place to get at that barbarian. If I have to. Oh, you won't have to. That would suit me. It would suit me, too, and my family. But uh, tell me something, sire, if it pleases you. Why have you not attacked already? Orders. Or perhaps I was waiting for a bright person like yourself to step forward. Yes, General, I understand. No, farmer. We have no designs on your village. You can trust us. We're Hisazu's army. <laughs> I was saving this for the harvest festival, but might as well drink it now. Might as well. Drunk or sober, dead is dead. I suppose it could take its toll. One drink. A toast to our passing. Maybe it's got your clan to remember. I remember too much. Battles. Wars. Life. Death. All of that. What about the happy times? There were happy times. But surely you have memories of a more tender nature? 
Some. I wish I did. Now it appears I never will. You should have a name. There's a word. Rasheen. It means blue sky. That's your name. Rasheen. Rasheen. It suits you. You suit me, Conan. It is not death, I fear, only where I will end up. I know, I will not be alone. We will talk when we get there. Out of the way, Oaf. He's not going anywhere without me. <clears throat> it appears the battle will be getting early today, and not with the enemy we expected. A battle's a battle. Surrender to the soldiers, or your friends die. Well, what's your decision, Conan? I could kill a dozen of you before I die. Yes, but what about those two? They are going to die anyway. Now let them go or pay the price. Wait! It is truly a pity that you have chosen this time to end your life. Now! that you have the force you need to free yourself from both the monster and Hisazul's army. What do you mean? How can you stop either one? How can you? That army could lay waste to this entire village after lunch and still not miss dinner. 
Haven't you wondered why they haven't attacked? Could it be that somewhere in this village, there's a spy? Shh, a spy. It's not odd for an army to place a spy in a village they're about to raid. Ask him. I'm not. I'm no friend of those soldiers. If there's a way to keep this village safe, I'll listen to it. If not, then I will do what I must. Make your choice now. Well, we'll take him and let those two go. No. No conditions. Maybe you want this village to fall for some reason. I'll do what you wish. I hope your gods and your will are stronger than mine. So do I. What do we do now? Now, we get to the truth. Much of a plan. There is no other. We have to find out why they have not yet attacked us. They're afraid of something here in the village. I don't think it is us. Good point. What if the sentries don't know anything? They know. Soldiers always do. We don't. We ready then. I want to help. It is too dangerous. I'm already risking my life just being in this village. If you leave, they'll kill me. And if you fail, we'll all die anyway. Not yet. Let them become more careless. That's fine with me. Conan, I don't like this. I know you're fond of her, but that does not mean she can be trusted. I like you too. All I can give is trust.
wrong man. You would risk your life to save one of the enemy? There's a common enemy. It has to be killed. Rashid! What happened to him? He's cold. And bloodless. How could that be? It took us blood. What did? The creature. But... but we... You killed it! Maybe there's another one. Rasheen! I'm fine, Conan. Did you see any more of those creatures around? No. But to tell you the truth, I was afraid to look. Conan. Conan. Can we go back now? Ran away, stinking cowards! The beast has taken many of them. The others retreated. I shall execute every captain, every lieutenant, every sergeant even. And as for that general man, I know a stinking antique where he can spend a nice, long time. I recognize your rage, O oh wise one, but tell me the reason. Have you no ears? Literally speaking, no, but... Well, then do not mock me, Skull. I'm not in the mood. My army has abandoned Conan. Perhaps, but Conan must still survive the monster. Then let us pray that you are right. Pray? That's a new word for you, master. A trick of the tongue. But you still better get it right. Well, if there's one thing a farmer can provide, it's food. May you have a smooth and peaceful journey. You're leaving? We have to go before the soldiers regroup. I can remember now. Almost everything. Your friends, your family. Can you go back to them? I don't have a family. Then, where would you go? To make my own family. Ashim. I shouldn't call you that anymore. No, I'm keeping the name. You gave it to me. And now, you can give me something else.
There is no time right now. We have to leave. There's plenty of time. The soldiers don't know the beast is dead yet, and if they decide to check, they'll send a scout or two. Not an entire army. You needn't worry about us. We'll find something to do. It's hard to believe that someone of your size was once a babe in arms. I was not a child for long. No. Nor will I be. I've waited so long for this. Two days. Much can happen in two days. The lowly caterpillar becomes a butterfly in mere hours. Now, come to me. Rasheen, I can't be here to raise a family. My children will only need their father for a single night. My race is a self-sufficient one. We expect to take care of ourselves. And it starts at a young age. My Conan. Come to me. That creature couldn't have killed those soldiers. It was dead before they were. I'm sure of it. Like Conan said, maybe it was another one of those accursed creatures. And how did R R R Rasheen avoid it? My what? Be calm, my Conan. There's nothing to fear. It's a normal transition for my race. Two days as the Christmas ration. And now this. That monster! You never were in danger! It was my mother. The seed of our race is the blood of men. Accept it, Conan. Our goal is the same as yours. To populate the world with our offspring. The offspring of strong warrior fathers like you, whose memory I will always cherish. Mela! I die first! Come to me, Conan. Come to me. Give yourself to me. Conan! I feel up my sword! No! You mustn't. <laughs> I really do love you. I still don't believe Rasheen turned into that thing. An egg becomes a chicken. A nymph becomes an old crone.
Will you travel with us? For a while, till I get where I'm going. In any event, I'm sorry, Conan. Truly, I'm sorry. For what? The girl. You had feelings for her. Must be painful. She was so beautiful. Yeah. For two days. For many, two days of beauty could be a whole lifetime. Yes, if you intend to live for only four days. He doesn't live life enough to really feel it. What could you offer a woman? What could you? I have brains. I have strength. I have guile. What is guile? My point exactly. If you have insulted me again, I will still watch you like a gnat. If I called you a buffoon, that's an insult. If I called you an idiot, that's an insult. You should calm down. Perhaps you're correct. I'm sorry. Accepted. You do know what accepted means, don't you? Seven, you should translate. You should admire what he does so well. So I'm, I'm to be thankful for the insult heaps upon me. I should accept them like the, like the good pain of a man who likes the feeling of a stomach cramp? Is no one on my side? Crom! Pray to Crom. He once saved a horse of mine. <laughs>